All right, I'm headed out, guys. Wish me luck on this hunt. By the way, if you see me touching things like that, it's because um, it's because I want to be able to leave a DNA trail. And by the way, if you're wondering what got me here, my name is Tommy, and I work for a bail company that would prefer not be said. And all my gears in this backpack, I haven't dressed out yet. I am. My manager's not home, and I bounty hunt basically out of my bedroom with a bicycle. Why? Because. I'm not very good at this new camera thing. I'm used to being able to pull this out one hand, two handed. I have to pull it out. Because one, driving is more dangerous, and two, let's say the person takes off, you can just take off after him in a bike. Here's what I do I could videotape the police if I wanted to, but I don't because I want to be friends with the police. Like, right? The police in my town aren't very big about being videotaped. I mean, maybe if I'm working in another town, I could videotape the <laughs> But I'm a bounty hunter, and what a bounty hunter does is basically, if a bail bondsman bonds someone out of jail, and they don't show up to court, then it's called skipping bail. And I hunt down people who skip bail. And before I finish explaining this very complex bail skippers process, Let me explain to you, or uh, let me send you back to what led me to catching this guy. show. I'm Tommy, and I hunt down few Jews. I'm a Texas hunting bounty hunter. So, due to a recency of, recent, a recent shortish, shortage of staff, cough cough people with bounty hunting license, I've been working alone. Do I like it? Hell no. I need a partner. I hate working alone. I enjoy having a partner, having a friend. I'm still friends with my old partners. Maybe I'll have them on the show sometime. But, um, this is my whiteboard where all of my hunts begin. This is where everything starts. And so let me show you who we're hunting down today. His name is... I jacked it up, hold on. I do this a lot, especially when I write. He's about five, five foot, three inches. It's criminal mischief.
Japanese male, Indian, and short. Um, what else do I have on? Well, I have addresses and phone number, but I'm not going to write that up here until I cut. So, what else can I put up here? Oh, he's convicted. Two time before on C or criminal criminal um yeah that's all the, about all the information that legally I can write on the board because I start writing you know a license plate number I know he has a white infinity. about everything I can put. Alright. Let's get to hunting. Alright, so I have his phone number of my phone. And by the way, this background is very messy. It's a it's my bedroom slash my office, so there's that. I have gear over here. I have paper over here, and I have a bed over there, and I have a chalkboard over there. I'm gonna give him a call. Hello? Dude, listen. You're wanted on failure to appear. I know where you live. You need to come to my office. And... Hung up on me. Well, that's a bus. I have his address. So I have his mom's phone number, so I'm basically just going to call his mom. Hello? Is this Pavan? Oh, this is Mother. Uh, oh, oh, hi, Mother. How are you? Oh, I'm okay. Oh, I am in Bill from uh, Houston, Sweet State. I, I have big award for Pavan. Big, big, big award. And I, I just, I just wonder if he home. Maybe I can stop by the house. Okay, I stopped by about five o'clock this afternoon. Okay, okay, bye bye. That was nice. It worked. He's home, and he's gonna be home at five o'clock. So I'm gonna drive over there at five. Cut to the hunt. Alright guys, we're out front right now. I gotta be really freaking quiet. And um the vit camera's gonna fly. What are you? you? Freeze! Freeze right there! Freeze! Freeze right there! Freeze right there! Who the hell are you? Right there. Freeze Freeze right there. Jess. Who the hell are you? Put your hands behind your back. 
Watcher. Other oh, end. You're a bounty hunter. Where's my trial? The one you didn't show up to? Uh, I want a lawyer. Let go of me. I want my money that you missed from not showing up to court. Stand up. Stand up. The hell else did I drop? That's it. I'm from bail bonds. Your bond has been voided due to failure to appear. You didn't show up in court. Stand right I, here. I need to. I need to get to court. Stand, stand, turn around, dude. You can't be doing this. You gotta show up to court, dude. You're just gonna get your ass more in trouble. Look, dude. I see people get mixed up in the law all the time. What's your charge? Graffiti. Graffiti. Vandalism. It's a criminal mischief, dude. You're probably looking at a hundred dollar fine at most. Or more. more, no, you're not. I know the court. I know the courthouse. No one understand at all. Okay. What do I not understand? You got you got busted vandalizing. How, is this a repeated offense? Because right now you're looking at a class. B misdemeanor. I've done it three times. Okay, so maybe you're looking at 24 hours in jail. At most, dude. At most. I see, I've seen people going to jail for the rest. Val, well, I'll take care of you from here. You need anything before you go? Call your parents? Call anyone? No. All right, that's it. You're the one who ran? Look, I will kill you all for this. Okay, your cuffs are staying in the back for that. Alright guys, so basically at this point, I'm just... I'm gonna hand him over to the police. There's... It's the best I'd try. Alright dude, before... So you don't need smokes, you don't need anything before I hand you over to the police. Nothing. So you want to go to jail for threatening at this point? Fuck you. I will kill all of you. I swear on God. We well, can swear on God all you want. I've had many people say that before and they haven't actually carried out with it. Alright. Well, that's it for this point. Bye.